Hello, my friends. It is time for, this is going to be different. I'm just going to put it out there. It is going to be a plan with me um, with a whole different planner, y'all. So I've been debating. <laughs> I've been going back and forth if I wanted to try out the uh, common planner for reasons of just pure insanity. Um, I think just the fact that the the spreads are a little bit more clean and um, I don't know. I mean, I love that, you know, that nice silky paper. But yeah, I think just for the fact of it's so much like the Hobonichi Cousin, but differenter. Um, I love the, like in the Hobonichi Cousin, I love the fact that it has the daily pages in the back. Um, however, the last year I really struggled with wanting to use it. And I think it had a lot to do with the fact that they were dated. Now, 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 listen, I could always cover them up and do whatever I want. Um, but something is just a little more freeing in, first of all, the, a little more, it's just a little more clean layout in the uh, common planner for the weekly spread. Um, and then just the fact that the pages are free, empty, naked, what have you in the back. Um, and then, so I can use them and just date them as I go. If I don't use that many, oh, well, um, I mean, I will still do like my regular memory planning style and just fill the pages full of, you know, things that I print out. Um, yeah, I just, I don't know. I, I just kept thinking about it. I kept thinking about it and then I couldn't stop thinking about it. So then I just hit that purchase button. And so this is actually the two book, um, just like the, uh, Hobonichi Avec version. So this is the two book of the common planner. So you get... Uh, part one, which is January through June, and then you get the part two, um, July through December. So I don't know. I've just been really struggling with the fact that I really, for whatever reason, I just want to combine my weekly spread planning with my memory planning and my journaling daily pages in one planner. I know that's a lot. Like we start talking about planner peace and I want planner peace and what's going to make me feel good, good, um, or what's going to make me feel better in a planner. And I just, I, I really always want to be one of those planners that just uses one planner for everything. I want to, like, I want that, but I also know that certain things for me in a planner, like I, I need certain different planner sizes for different things. Um, but as far as like for my weekly spread and my memory planning, memory keeping journaling, that is going to stay at home. Like that's never going to be a planner that I'm going to need to take out anywhere. So a five size is perfect. Like it's not, it's, you know, I'm Goldie plans. It's not too big and it's not too small. It's just right. <laughs> so a five size is perfect. And then um, just the fact that I can have a weekly spread that I can see everything that's going on in the week, you know, on two page spread. And then I can also have my pages for journaling, memory keeping and everything. Whew, that's a lot. I know. I know. Um, but yeah. And also there's just a little few things about Hobonichi Cousin that doesn't get me excited or just, it's kind of like annoyances, but you know, we're, we like to try new stuff around here. That's the name of my game. Um, I mean, we like to we like to use our stash, but we also like to try new stuff. So this is me being different in April, seeing how this goes, if I can combine everything in here. Um, so first of all, as I've been blabbering on, um, I wanted to use, I bought a new set of Tombows and they are the bright that just, it just says bright. <laughs> and I mean, they are bright. So I guess, you know, like the Tombos, you can buy them individual, which I do on jet pins, but then you can also buy the packs that are pre-selected, pre, yeah, put together. Um, so yeah, this one is the quote unquote bright version of Tombos in a pack. Um, so I wanted to use them, but then my brain went uh left 
and I decided that I wanted to use them, but I wanted to use them like watercolors. And so the awesomeness about using Tombows as watercolors is they dry super fast. Like if you use watercolor, you'll have to sit there and let it dry or you'll have to get the hair dryer or one of those fancy dryers to like, you know, but by the time, you know, I was done with each day and then I made it wait like my way back to the first day, like it's dry. So, and if you have, which I feel like a lot of us have Tombows or even, um, uh, mild liners. They work the same way. So I just used one of my old Erin Condren, um, one of the reusable, uh, switchable, uh, planner covers from when I was using Erin Condren, uh, last year and like all the years before. So I just used one of those and that's like my paint palette in essence. So I was able to just use the Tombows and just kind of like do some swishes. And then I got my little it's like one of those um, watercolor brushes that you can actually put the water in the brush, but um, I don't think I really used it that way. I just really used it for my watercolor brush, and I would just swish it, you know, swish, swish into the, the Tombows for my color. And so I went ahead and I chose this really bright, pretty pink one for, um, this was going to be for my day-specific stuff. And this one is number 743. Um, it is a beautiful bright pink because I knew I needed something bright that was going to go against uh, these stickers because I spun the wheel, y'all. I didn't film it. I'm so sorry. I spun the wheel and I chose this number six book, which is the 1000 plus ridiculously cute, absolutely necessary, crazy, fabulous, awesome, stellar, cool, phenomenal stickers series one. Oh my gosh, that's like the longest title ever. Um, and I freaking love this book. Like I am obsessed with this book. I flipped through it before. Um, Erica gave this to me when we were in Nashville together. So it is so like special, precious, all the things. Um, I love it so much. But also just flipping through this book, it has everything. And it is so my style. Like she knows me, y'all. This is very bright. It has all the fun, crazy stickers. It's got like little smiley faces. It's got everything from food to pictures of animal heads with glasses. I mean, it is so, it is so fun, crazy, um, out there. It is me. It is me if I were a sticker book. Um, so yeah, so this bright, beautiful pink was perfect for, um, to use as my little, like, I didn't want to use as much stickers as far as like box stickers. So that's why I kind of was like, well, let me put the day specific, specific, ooh, the day specific stuff, um, onto the Tombow coloring. And then I came across this washi that I haven't used in 50, 11 years. And so it's going to have some sticking problems as you will see, but I really love the bright, um, it's like a bright lime color. And then the little polka dots are purple, super cute. And it fit perfectly in that space up top. Um, so yeah, I'm putting that down and then I went ahead and wrote down all my day specific stuff. I had to add in a few more little zhuzhs of color because I was like, oh darn, I forgot this thing or oh darn, I forgot this other. And so yeah, so you see by the time I'm done with that, it's like everything is dry or that last one that I that I zhuzhed is dry. So yeah, Monday was going to be um, gym, the gym with my girl, my bestie. And then um, we needed to change the air filter because it is time, time, time. And then y'all, if y'all saw my last video or one of my last videos, you saw that I have been chosen for the jury duties. And it's so crazy because like I texted Erica and I told her, girl, they, they found me, they got me. And she was like, be quiet. Like I have jury duty the week after you. And I'm like, um, they are definitely listening. It's like, they know that we, um, we don't deserve this. So they picked us like basically in the same week. Is that not nuts? What are the odds? I haven't had jury duty or I haven't been, um, I haven't got the little summons thing since like, um, I want to say it's been like between eight to 10 years. So it's, I mean, I guess I've gotten away this long, but, um, anyway, so yeah, so that's uh, Wednesday. And then I just wanted to remind myself that I need to, um, 
swish and move around my monies for the sinking funds and then dinner at mama's. So then Thursday is this god awful program, this new program at work called 340B. And wait till you see the sticker that I put underneath there because <laughs> it's some B, all right. Um, and then Friday, I am taking off work because why not? Um, I just, you know, after so long, the, the hours just accumulate. And I hadn't taken off for Friday in a minute, so I thought I was I was due. So it's going to be a weird week. <laughs> I'm going to be off Wednesday and then Friday, but whatever, we're going to roll with it. Um, but yeah, what I actually was trying to do was schedule Miko for his grooming appointment. And then I'll probably end up doing a few other things, if I'm being quite honest. But yeah, really my thing is, is when I have my hair appointment on Saturday, I'm a hostage. Like it's a straight up hostage situation. Um, cause I get highlights, I go blonde, I do all the things that takes forever. So yeah, so that's why I'm like, you know, since Saturday is pretty much like sucked up at the hair salon, I like to take off Friday and just, you know, do whatever I want. But yeah, I, I, um, went ahead and scheduled Miko so he can get sexy too. So we're, we're both getting sexy. It's our sexy weekend. Um, and then it is one of my girl's birthdays on Saturday. So I just wanted to put that in there so I can make sure to text her and send her some love. And maybe, um, if she's free, maybe we can hang out and do something after I'm no longer a hostage. And then Sunday, oh, and then yeah, my hair appointment is at 10 on Saturday. And then Sunday is dinner at mama's. So then I was like, okay, what stickers can I pull from this uh, ridiculously cute, absolutely necessary, you know, all those words, um, this sticker book. So this one, this sticker, I feel like just captured my soul. It is like if Miko had glasses, you know, some cool little hippie glasses, that's how he would look. <laughs> and then, you know, cause he's getting his hair did on Saturday too. So I thought I would have him be the center of attention down there in the corner so that was super cute. And then this sticker cracks me up. <laughs> I really wanted to use it for the color, um, but putting it up there, it just kind of looks like some boobs that are like floating in the air. But, and then it says focus. <laughs> so it's like, it makes me think of like when, if you've ever had this happen to you girls um, or ladies, you're talking to, um, you're talking to someone that is looking at your chesticle region and you're like, hey, as up here, focus, focus. <laughs> but that sticker looks like it's saying, hey, focus on the boobs, but whatever. You focus on whatever you want to focus on. Um, and it, it ain't going to hurt my feelings. Um, so then I'm just looking through the stickers that I had laid out like already on my desk from <laughs> planning um, from my weekend list. And I was like, what other stickers can I use? So there was a cute little hair dryer I wanted to put down for my hair appointment. And then I, oh, so see, I had printed these out, these little bit emojis for um, the memory planning that I have yet to do, but I wanted to, I thought maybe if I start printing stuff, then I'm going to put myself in the mood. And um, I, I think I'm getting there. I'm getting there. <laughs> like I'm working my way through. I think once I really decided on using this planner, then I was like, oh yeah, it's go time because now I'm just going to go through and all the days that I really want to put, you know, certain kind of journaling or ephemera pictures, bitmojis. Um, yeah, I think, I think I talked myself into it. So, um, and you know, I go back and forth between wanting to be a little more functional. And then, then I go back and forth with being like more playful, you know, hence the watercoloring with the Tombos. So I feel like this planner with the undated pages, um, just each page can be whatever. And, you know, if I start out with April 1st, that's fine. If I decide to start back at January, that's fine. Like, I still haven't really even figured that out yet. But um, I think I'll just really just memory plan what speaks to me or what I really want to truly um, remember. You know, I do have my notebook. I always have a notebook going. I have the, is it the Planner Monkey Co? Yes. So I'm using the Planner Monkey Co notebook. It's just a gridded blank notebook. That's what I'm using to write down 
um, what happens each day. So I have been writing that down since January. So everything is in that notebook. Um, actually, I'm a liar. I started out in that Hobonichi A6. So once that got on my nerves and I couldn't handle that size anymore, then I moved over to the Planner Monkey Co. But yeah, everything is written down each day. So all I have to do is just flip through the pages and just, hey, when there was a day where something fun happened or there's a good story or, you know, I can look at my phone and pull some pictures, then I think that's probably where I'll start and just go from there. Um, yeah, so then what else did I do? Um, I added in my little bitmoji. <laughs> I found this one. I think I, I typed in like jury or court or something like that. And this popped up where it's me saying I object. <laughs> and I was like, yup, that's it. That's going in the planner. So that was perfect to put down at the bottom for Wednesday. And then, um, let's see, I'm just looking for some other decor. Um, I did already put down, I used some different colored Tombows for my, um, sidebar. So for the stuff that's on the way, I used dun, 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 133. It's a beautiful lime green, which I mean, it looks more lime green on the, the cap, but it kind of looks yellowish on the planner, to be quite honest. Because like I'm comparing it to the washi. The washi looks lime green to me. Um, but yeah, anyway, on the planner, it looks a little more yellow. It's fine. It's fine. We're fine. So then I wanted to put down a different color for tasks. And that is number 403. It's such a pretty bright blue. And then, um, yeah, so on the way, we've got Ulta stuff, Amazon stuff, Walmart stuff and things. And then tasks are uh, cash check. Um, it. I wrote plant pot. Y'all, that is not... That is not how I should have wrote that. I am not planting any pot, um, I promise. Um, I am in the pharmacy industry and I have a license <laughs> that I do not want to take it away. It is, so my, one of my plants in the living room, um, my little robot vacuum, Sharkira, she was, she must've been dancing. Her hips didn't lie or they did lie because she hit that plant so hard. It fell down and it, cracked like the side. So there's like a hole in the bottom, but like on the side. So when I put water in there, the water's coming out, the freaking plant food's coming out. I'm like, oh my gosh. So I need to get another one, um, as well as another water filter for the refrigerator, creamer, bananas, and I need to send Erica her mail um, for our, our soon-to-be future project. And then, y'all, I still need to clean the shower. It did not happen this past weekend. And I still need to buy some new shoes, like super bad. And then I put memory plan question mark. But we are gonna do it. We're gonna do something this weekend. I promise. <laughs> um. So then I put down at the bottom. Is it Friday yet? Question mark at the bottom of Thursday, which is pretty funny because I'm only working um Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday this week. So like, but you know, jury duty. That's a job. Have y'all been picked for jury duty? I was picked last time and I was there all day, like up until basically five o'clock. And you got to take notes. You got to listen. You got to pay attention. You got to be like, is she lying? Is he lying? Are they trash? I mean, it's a job. So, um, yeah. In anyways, so that little sticker went down there. And then you see my um, sticker on Thursday, that 340B, that poo-poo sticker. That's exactly how I feel about that 340B it is poo-poo. Poo-poo, caca, whatever you want to call it. And then um, that adorable little girl sticker. Oh my gosh, with her little wings and her bow in her hair. Um, I really wanted to put it down for Saturday. Like that could be me. But I just put it down on Friday just to take up some space, honestly. And, you know, I'm off work. So that could be me like walking around free as a bird uh, with my little wings on <laughs> or something. Um, so then I added some stickers over on the left. So I needed to change the air filter and I don't know what that sticker was supposed to be. It kind of looks like paper towels, the little guy's face, or he's like, oh my God. Um, it kind of looks like a filter too. So in my head, that's my filter sticker. And then I added um, some little hearts around dinner at Mama's 
And then, um, oh, I added another uh, poo-poo sticker up at the top next to jury duty because it's kind of poo-poo, but then she's got a party hat. Um, I don't know. It could be poo-poo. It, it might not be, though. Um, so then, let's see. Oh, I added the little paw sticker for Miko's grooming appointment over there. Um, and so, what am I doing? Oh, this is where I am pulling another color. Am I? Is that true? Oh, that's right. So I wanted to like highlight this week because um, it kind of looks sad and lonely, that little calendar just over there. So um, I wanted to mark the week that we're on. And then I was just going to like, you know, go over it with the Tombow. And then I'm like, no, this is like the whole watercolor theme. So um, yeah, I wanted to put down some of the orange orange so that I can watercolor over the four. It's like a huge four and then it says April, 2024. So, um, but yeah, this was so much fun. Like I love doing this when I memory plan and I'm like, why can't I just combine all the things that I love and just plan the same way? Like, why do I have to reserve watercoloring and, you know, all this kind of different stuff, like my little bit mojis and um, pictures and all that. Like, why do I have to reserve all that just for the memory planning daily pages? Like, no, this is my planner. I'm going to do what I want. <laughs> so I'm going to try to incorporate my memory planning style into my weekly planning style, if that makes sense. I don't know. We'll see. Um, oh, okay. So here I'm actually writing down all the things that I already told you, <laughs> all the stuff from my sidebar. Um, and it's just like, you know, things, well, other than the on the way, I mean, that's going to come when it comes, but the tasks are going to be more like, not necessarily day specific, just if I have some free time or when I get some free time. Um, yeah, just to kind of keep them as a focus, <sighs> you know, sometimes, well, and then I don't know if I've already done it, but I kind of reference back to my um, weekend list and just see like the things that I didn't get to do or didn't it's like hiding underneath the planner right now but yeah like I'll reference that as well and just be like okay what did I not get done you know what's going to turn into a repeat offender um, or what is constantly a repeat offender maybe I just need to move it to the next month or something I don't even know um, this month is busy y'all like as I'm writing this stuff down I'm already looking like it's there's a lot there's going to be a lot of things, but one day at a time, right? One day at a time, one week at a time, but I'm like already so in love with this spread and it's not even completed. Like my plan is to put this down. Like, um, if y'all watch, um, my girl, my sister from another mister, Miss Barbara, um, she likes to say like she does her memory or her, she does her weekly planning and she's like, okay, this is my skeleton. And then, <laughs> you know, you'll see the rest of it later on, you know, when she does her flip throughs or you can follow her on IG and she'll show her little flip through or her final product of the week. Um, yeah, so this is going to be like the skeleton and then I'm going to come back and show y'all. Um, not really sure if I'm going to do like a week in the life maybe or maybe I'll just do like a video um, showing like when it's all done, like everything put together. Because um, I still need to add and take some pictures of like what I'm reading, watching, all that kind of stuff. So, um, but yeah, here I'm just writing down on this little sticky note some things to um, like have in the back of my head because I need to do them, but not necessarily this week. You know, like I need, definitely need an oil change and then... This month is when um, I need to have my car inspected and then get the registration sticker. So uh, money, 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 money. That's all I hear. Um, yeah, a lot of things that need to be done, you know, adulting. Um, but yeah, I wanted to put that on that little sticky tab or the little sticky note because it has the little tab that hangs up at the top. So I can just put it like in the planner and then have the little tab sticking up to just remind me to, hey, there's something here. Look back. Look back at it, girl. <laughs> hey, look back at it. Um, and then this washi was already driving me nuts because it's 100 years old. So I had to put some little, um, some glue to hold it down. And then, okay, so here's where I'm going back to 
If you saw my last video, this was my weekly list um, where I split up my Cinderella chores and then the things that I like to do or enjoy doing. So yeah, I think I was just marking off. Yeah, meal plan. We don't need to do that this week. It's pretty much back to normal. Um, we're not doing any feud. feud. <laughs> we're not feuding. We're not doing any food challenges or there's nothing that's going to keep me from um, just making whatever I want for dinner, basically. So yeah, meal plan is not not a not important. And then um, yeah, I'm just adding down the rest of the things that I didn't get done. So you already know, clean the shower. That's just one of them things that if I never had to do that again, oh my gosh. And then um, yeah, the shoe shopping must continue, as well as memory plan. But I promise, like I'm really I'm really in the zone now with. Um, I got a plan. <laughs> There's a plan of action and I'm really going to at least get started and like film a page with y'all of memory planning. So coming soon, coming soon. I still need to film my the rest of my Hobonichi daily pages that I finished from last year as well. So that's coming, coming soon, coming soon. But yeah, this is just about wrapped up guys. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you like this different kind of style. It's like the same, but different <laughs> coming from me. And I love y'all so much. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.